With winter approaching, watch this short video to learn six ways to winterize your home. Hi, I'm Blake Davenport with the Davenport Group. I'm a local realtor here in the DC metro area, here to share with you short and simple real estate tips. Today we're gonna to be talking about six ways to winterize your home. With the winter months approaching, it's very important that you do certain things to winterize your home so you're not faced making costly repairs. Number one, seal any air leaks. This is gonna to pertain to your windows and doors. If your windows and doors are not properly insulated, your uh, energy bills could go up by several hundred dollars a month. So it's important, very important that you look at these areas, particularly your windows, make sure that they're all shut. If you have older windows, consider adding a storm window. Also maybe consider adding blinds or a curtain as another level of protection. Um, and then front doors, you know, they sell those things that you put on the front door so you uh, don't allow any um, air to get out. Very important. Number two, secure exterior features like roof tiles, siding, and shutters with extreme wind, ice, and moisture. It can cause damage to these, especially if there's some roof tiles. If moisture or water is getting underneath them, it can cost thousands of dollars if you have to replace the roof or repair a leaking roof in the middle of winter. Number three, clean your gutters. Uh, when leaves from the fall get in your gutters and then you don't clean them out and then water gets in there, it can create ice dams. So ice dams is when basically it freezes over and then it pushes the water underneath your roof. And again, causing damage to your roof, very expensive, clean your gutters. Number four, insulate your exposed pipes. It's very important that you do this. I've had several clients and, and have walked in on several homes where uh, there was a burst pipe that everything was leaking because uh, there was frozen pipes because it was very cold outside. So make sure that you insulate your pipe. It's very cheap. You can just buy those um, you know, foam um, wraps that go around the pipes. So any pipes that you have to the outside, especially in older homes where you have a crawl space, make sure you get under there and you insulate all of your pipes because that can cost thousands of dollars if your water freezes in the middle of winter. Number five, trim any overhanging branches over your roof, over your driveway. These are gonna freeze with high winds. They could snap, they could break, they could cause damage to your roof or your car, or they could fall on somebody as they're outside like a child. Um, so make sure you trim your, any overhanging branches. Number six, have your HVAC service. We always recommend that you get under contract with an HVAC provider that will come um, before your heat turns on and before your uh, AC turns on, so twice a year, and they'll fine tune your machine. This is one of the most expensive systems uh, in your home, you know, ranging from five to $10,000 to replace. So you wanna make sure that this is working the best way possible. Also, you don't wanna have to replace your system in the middle of winter, because that's gonna, when it's gonna be really expensive to have it done. So get on a maintenance schedule and have it tuned up. If you like a recommendation for that, we'd be happy um, to give you a recommendation. Just shoot us a message. So there you have it. That's six ways to winterize your home. To recap, they are, Number one, seal any air leaks. Number two, secure exterior features. Number three, clean your gutters. Number four, insulate exposed pipes. Number five, trim overhanging branches. And number six, have your HVAC serviced. So it's very important that you do this so you don't end up spending a lot of money in the spring to repair your home or in the winter when it's gonna cost a lot to bring some, uh, someone out. If you like this video, please click the like icon. If you have a comment, leave us a comment below or feel free to reach out to us. Also, click the subscribe button if you haven't done it already and click the bell icon to be notified of our next video. But thanks again for checking out this week's real estate tip on six ways to winterize your home. Go, go.